10th April 2007 would go down as one of the epic nights of European football at Old Trafford. Italian giants AS Roma were the visitors and the Red Devils were looking to overturn a 2-1 deficit from their first leg at Italy. The tensions were high inside the stadium. Michael Carrick stood in the 11th minute and the result of the tie never looked in doubt after that. Now, Alan Smith, Wayne Rooney and Cristiano Ronaldo added four more goals between them before Michael Carrick got his second of the night. Now, Daniel De Rossi got the mere consolation for AS Roma before Patrice Evra got the seventh goal for United and completed the route. They won 7-1 on the night and 8-3 on aggregate and marched on to the semis. So where are the starting 11 of Manchester United currently that demolished the Italian giants and produced one of those scintillating attacking displays in a European night at Old Trafford? Well, let's find out. Edwin van der Sar One of Sir Alex Ferguson's great regrets has been to not have signed the Dutchman earlier from Juventus. Now, but the Dutchman in his six years at the club made up for it. Now, he went 1,032 minutes without conceding a goal, which is a club record. Now, in a six trophy laden years at United, he won four Premier League titles and a Champions League title. Now, he retired in 2011 but returned to play a single game for his boy club Nordwick in 2016. Wes Brown The Mancunian lad who was at the club since 1992 appeared for Manchester United over 200 times before moving to Sunderland in 2001 in search of regular first team football. Now, before moving to Sunderland, he won five Premier League titles and two Champions League titles with the club amongst 14 trophies at Old Trafford. Now, he spent the 2016-17 season with Blackburn Rovers and is currently a part of the under-23 coaching team at the Lancashire Club. John O'Shea The versatile Irishman played at a lot of positions for United including goalkeeper against Tottenham Hotspurs. He was a fan favourite at the club and was at United since 1999 and was a part of five Premier League winning squads. He scored the famous goal at the Cop End in 2007, a memory which is inked in the hearts of the Old Trafford faithful. Along with Brown, he left the club for Sunderland in 2015 and has been playing there since. Rio Ferdinand the former Leeds defender joined Manchester United in 2002 and stayed at the club till 2014. Now, he enjoyed a highly successful career at the club, winning six Premier League titles and a Champions League title. Now, he joined QPR in 2014 and retired a year later. He currently works as a pundit with BT Sport. Gabriel Heinze the Argentine fullback joined United in 2004 from French club PSG. The stylish left-footed player left the club in 2007 after winning the Premier League title. He went to Spanish giants Real Madrid and won the La Liga in the 2007-8 season. After that, he joined Marseille in 2009 where he again won the league in his first season at the club. He ended his career in Argentina with Newville's Old Boys, which was his boyhood club. Darren Fletcher A product of the Manchester United Academy, the Scotsman spent 20 years at the club and won Fry Premier League titles. Now, Despite splitting opinion in his early United career, he was a fan favourite in the latter part of his career at Old Trafford. He joined West Bromwich Albion in 2015 and after two years at the club, joined Stoke City in 2017. Cristiano Ronaldo The 2006-07 season was the year that Ronaldo actually came into his own in United Colours and led the Premier League. Now He lifted three successful Premier League titles with the club and the Champions League title in 2008. Now, he left for Spanish giants Real Madrid in 2009, where he has continued his immense performance. He became Madrid's all-time leading goalscorer in 2015 and also won the European Championships with Portugal in 2016. He was also ranked the world's highest played athlete by Forbes in 2016 and 17. Ryan Giggs 
the welshman is among the rare breed of players who have stayed all their career at a single club now giggs played his last match for united during the disastrous reign of david moyes he also managed the club in the same year for a brief period after moyes was sacked in april 2014 he also served as Louis van Gaal's assistant manager for the two years that the Dutchman was at the club. Now he made over thousand appearances for club and country in his career and is the record appearance holder for Manchester United. Michael Carrick. Carrick is the only member of that team who beat Roma who is still at the club. Now currently he is made the cup captain by Jose Mourinho for the 17-18 season after the departure of Wayne Rooney to Everton. Now he has spent 11 years at the club and notched up 459 appearances for the Red Devils. He will begin his 12th season at the club which could possibly be his last at Old Trafford. Wayne Rooney. Another Manchester United record holder. The Everton man who joined in 2004 holds a record for the most goals in a Manchester United shirt overtaking Sir Bobby Charlton last year. He won 5 Premier League titles, a Champions League title and a Europa League title at his time at the club. He joined his boyhood club Everton in 2017 to play under Ronald Koeman. Alan Smith Like Rio Ferdinand, the English striker was a former Leeds United player and was signed after Leeds United were relegated from the Premier League in 2003-04 season. He broke his leg and dislocated his ankle in 2006 and his Old Trafford career never recovered after that. After brief spells in the first team, Smith left the club in 2007. He is currently at Nottingham County, which is a club in the League 2 of England football. And with that we come to the end of the list of the starting 11 and what happened to them after the demolition of Italian giants AS Roma and a great night at Old Trafford. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please like, share and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Until next time this is Abhimanyu signing off.